right YouTube it's Friday weekend's here what's good YouTube it's your man the son of some man son, who's my son who's my son who's my son who's my son and we are back back with a brand new video what's up guys what's going on how you doing hope you guys are having a great Friday evening but if you were brand new please do me a favor hit that subscribe button down below as we are climbing to 10,000 subscribers. And if you hit that subscribe button, you'll help us, you know, get that much more closer to hitting our goal. So please do me a favor, do yourself a favor, hit that subscribe button down below. Also, if you're brand new to the channel, please do me a favor, hit the notification bell. It'll let you know every time we drop a brand new video around here. Obviously you like sneaker content. There's a reason why you click this video. Now that we're, uh, you know, past the intro, you guys are probably taking a look at this primo primo crew neck i got well i got this from the boys over at eight and nine baby yeah man if you want to get clothes like this shop at eight and nine links are in the description make sure you check them out also use my code some man to save 15 to 20 percent off your entire purchase i'm telling you man the quality of of what these guys send me top tier if you haven't seen the video of me unboxing, uh, just click the link at the top of the screen and it'll take you directly to that video. But make sure you bring your behind back here because you, you're not going to want to miss this video. But anyway, guys, once again, we're here to talk about a Air Jordan 3 in 2023. You know, we had a lot of discussion with the reimagined. Everybody's calling them out for the inconsistencies. So I figured, you know what? Why not let's let's you know take a deeper look at you know the next major release for the Air Jordan 3 coming up is the Air Jordan 3 Washington Wizards PE. Now I already did a review on this uh shoe as well, a review went on foot, so if you want to check that out, all you gotta do is scroll down on my page and uh you can check it out. The video is actually done pretty well. I did an on foot too, so be sure to uh, check it out. But anyway, guys, today we're here to check out the Air Jordan 3 Washington Wizards PE. Now, I'm going to put them up against the Air Jordan 3 reimagines because I'm not going to sit here and lie. These actually look really, really good. It looks like they took their time with this shoe and the reimagines, they were just pumping them out, pumping them out, pumping them out. Obviously, this doesn't release yet. This doesn't release until... I believe the end of April. Uh, I've said it before, I'll say it again. Don't quote me on the dates because I really don't know. I, but I've seen I've seen someone say something about April 30th. But uh, I got these from my good people over at JM Sneakers. Also, if you want to check those guys out too, the links are in the description. JM Sneakers, they take extra good care of me. And I'm sure if you let them know that I sent you, they'll take good care of you as well. All right, let's get out both shoes. I'm not going to do a full detailed review because like I said, I did a detailed review on this shoe. If you want to Oopsie. <laughs> if you want to check out the uh, you know, the detailed review went on foot, like I said before, all you got to do, you know what? Maybe I'll put a little bit of uh, I'll put a little box up here. You can click that, you know, but make sure you come back here and finish this video because we're going to take a look at these and we're going to take a look at those back there, the Air Jordan 3 reimagined. All right. This is what I got from Nike. This is the pair I got from Nike, the 11 and a half. Now, as for the inconsistencies, you could actually see it right here. I don't know if you guys could see that with the, but it's always been like that, the, uh, the inconsistency with the elephant print. But what I'm not getting is, dude, this doesn't really look inconsistent on this pair. Well, now that you take a closer look at it, listen, dude, no matter how perfect they look, they're going to have inconsistencies on them, no matter what. The elephant print, yeah, you see this too, the elephant print here, take a look at it, sorry guys, the elephant print here, as you can see that, they're different, they're not the same style, it's all different patterns, but what I'm saying is, I feel like this shoe is better made. I don't I I don't understand why. But then you grab Oh no, let's grab this one. Then you grab this shoe. Alright guys, so 
we'll jump right into it. We'll take a look at the, let's take a look at the back elephant print. Now, do these look consistent to you? I don't think so. But as we know, Air Jordan, you know, the Air Jordan 3, the elephant print was never consistent. It's different on my 1994s. It's just, it's just been different. Like I said, I never knew that the shades of gray would be different. But can you guys see the shape of the shoe? This has a more of an 88 shape. See, it's got the slimmer toe. And this one has more of a, uh, I don't know, it's kind of slim, but it's, it's not. I don't know, it's weird. I don't know if you guys could see that on camera, but I could see that right here, how this one is a lot more slim, the toe, you know, the toe box. But as for overall, man, they're both, both nice shoes, dude. Really, really nice shoes. Check out the back. As you know, the Washington Wizard PE has the Jumpman and the Reimagine has the uh, Nike Air. Honestly, imagine if they put the Nike Air on this. Forget about it. This shoe will go through the roof. I think this shoe is going to go through the roof anyway. As far as fit goes, I believe they fit pretty much true to size, true to any, you know, Air Jordan 3. These I actually got in a size 11 and a half because I've been getting size 11s and they really, really haven't been fitting me, uh, you know, well. Like I got my breads back here, the bread fours. They're a size 11. I think they're 11 and a half, I'm sorry. And they're still tight on me, so. Yeah, if I was you, I would go a half size up on this pair, 100%. And the leather on the white cement three uh, seems a little bit better, but this, the, the build of this one feels a little bit better than this. I don't know, it's just weird if you ask me. But anyway, guys, let me know down in the comment section what you guys think. Did you guys pick these up? Are you guys going after these? I'd love to hear it. I know today's a short video. I had to do some, uh, you know, neurological work today too, so kind of feeling out of it. But guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I truly, truly appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart, man. Day in, day out. Until next time, it is your man, the son of some man, and we're out, guys.